We're going to pick back up on page 207 right after line 540. So line 541. The herald placed the gift in Demodocus's hands and the famous blind bard received it, overjoyed. They reached for the good things that lay outspread, and when they put aside desire for food and drink, Odysseus, master of many exploits, praised the singer. I respect you, Demodocus, more than any man alive. Surely the muse has taught you, Zeus's daughter, or god Apollo himself. How true to life, all too true, you sing the Achaeans' fate, all they did and suffered, all they soldiered through, as if you were there yourself or heard from one who was. But come now, shift your ground, sing of the wooden horse, Epius built with Athena's help, the cunning trap that good Odysseus brought one day to the heights of Troy, filled with fighting men who laid the city waste. Sing that for me, true to life as it deserves, and I will tell the world at once how freely the muse gave you the God's own gift of song. We're going to pause here and answer another question. 